Taken from just outside the 30. Escapes the defender. Oh, and now he bowls him over. Well, that looked for a second like he might take it all the way, but as it stands, it's still a massive return. And it'll be a short field for the Broncos as they take over first and 10. And Denver getting set to take the field. And this is really the start to the season that you're hoping for if you're a coach or a player. They've got the big lead here in the fourth quarter and now can really take some time off the clock. They're coming out with a jumbo package to start the drive. Watch the screen, watch the screen. Watch the screen, baby. Throwing now is locked. And he's got his favorite target yet again. It's complete. And they are able to stop him, but he does take it all the way to the two. A well-executed 22-yard gain. There's a beautiful thrower there, and he's been sensational the entire game. He's moving it around, spreading it, hitting the right guys. And look, under normal situations, partner, I would expect him to come out of the game now. They've got it in hand. But you and I have been around this league a long time, and every time we ask head coaches about it, and he will take it in for a Bronco touchdown. Taking it in from two yards out, and the Broncos continue to pour it on. I think all teams probably like seeing that schedule for the first time, looking at week one, oh good, we're at home. This is why you want to be home in week one. They're looking sharp. And I agree with you totally. That's what you want, but there carries a little extra pressure with that as well because you and I both know protecting the home field, winning your home games is paramount in this league. So you go into it, yeah, we want it, but now you actually have to go out and prove it. Yeah, two sides of that coin and looking like they're going to protect it here in this one. This one was over a while ago as they just add on to their big lead. They had the short field and they made quick work of it. Just two plays to get into the end zone. Brandon McManus to kick off for Denver. After the touchdown, here's McManus.